from Indie Streaming News Leader. This is a WRTV update. I'm Mark Mullins bringing you the latest WRTV headlines. Memorial Day marked a time to remember the men and women who made the ultimate sacrifice for our freedom. But sometimes the families they left behind are forgotten. Folds of Honor, a national nonprofit, aims to lift up those families after the tragic loss of a loved one. The organization provides educational scholarships for the families of fallen and disabled veterans and first responders. Folds of Honor says it's a different way to pay tribute to them and for the families, it helps ease another burden. I think I was just in this raw state of emotion and, and it was just hard to even think past how I was going to get through the day, let alone how I was going to continue to pay our mortgage or, or the kids' tuition. Um, and so it was just a day-by-day -day situation of trying to survive. If you think about it, if, if we honor their sacrifice by educating their legacy, then we can be doing something that reduces a long-term impact of that loss. The organization grants anywhere from 60 to 110 scholarships annually on average in Indiana. The scholarships can be used for a private school, tutoring, trade school, or higher education. When you host nearly 350,000 people, chances are they're going to leave a mess. And that's why the greatest spectacle in cleanup has become an annual tradition the day after the Indy 500. People from many different organizations, including churches and schools, spent the morning helping crews pick up trash around the IMS grounds. Track officials say they rely on these volunteers to get things back to tip-top shape. Solid Rock Baptist Church in Pendleton volunteered to raise money for their teens to go to summer camp and for a block party. It's just good to be able to get this large chunk of money at one get-go. I mean, instead of having to do many, many fundraisers, car washes, bake sales, we're able to come here a couple of days and make a lot of money, and the kids are able to go camp, and they get all their work done in like two days. So we like that. After volunteering for four to five days, Solid Rock Baptist expects to make somewhere between six to $8,000.